Now, dozens of people are reported to have been killed in a major fire at an apartment block in the Vietnamese capital, Hanoi. Well, state media says that many others have been taken to hospital. The blaze is said to have started just before midnight on Tuesday. Well, Jessica Washington joins us live on the phone now from Canto in Vietnam. Well, Jessica, what more can you tell us? Well, while this is still a developing situation, I'll just talk you through the information that we have at this stage. As you said, uh, state media says that dozens have been killed. Uh, still no uh, clarity as to exactly how many victims there are. We've seen some pictures showing rescue workers carrying out victims. Uh, what we've heard is that the blaze started around 17 GMT and was contained uh, within a few hours. Around 70 individuals were rescued. Among them, 54 people rushed to hospital. According to Vietnam's official news agency, this was a serious fire, um, and it took place in a residential area in southwest Hanoi. Fatalities, as I mentioned, still unclear. We have also heard from uh, some of the health workers assisting in that effort of uh, helping those who were injured in this fire. A doctor from a local hospital nearby said that uh, some of the survivors were in a situation of being in extreme distress. Uh, one patient had severe spinal injuries from falling out of the building, uh, and a mother and her baby were also suffering from severe smoke inhalation. And just to give you some context here of building fires in Vietnam, last year a fire in a karaoke bar killed more than 30 people in Ho Chi Minh City. 17 others were injured. Uh, and so the context here is that these building fires do take place uh, rather often here in Vietnam. Uh, and in, in this particular instance, local authorities uh, have been urged uh, by the central government to deploy all resources. Uh, police have already begun their investigation as to the cause of the fire. Some witnesses said that they saw the fire start in the parking lot. The other context here is that in a densely populated city like Hanoi, people are living in very crowded, close quarters. And safety considerations are often perhaps put to the side as, as people are living very densely packed and some buildings often don't have the safety standards uh, that perhaps would be ideal, uh, buildings with perhaps limited escape routes or indeed situations where people have put uh, bars on their windows. So that's just sort of the general context. Uh, for this situation, this is still a developing situation. Uh, and in terms of fatalities, we, we do hope to hear uh, some clearer information from authorities in coming hours. Jessica, for now, thanks very much indeed for that update.